Spencer, when you fish swordfish at night, you rig differently than for almost any other type of fishing that I can think of. Show me how you rig. Well, we got a dual speed Penn International filled with 50 pound line. We have a wind on leader of 300 pound test. It's about 20 feet long. We're gonna use a six to 10 foot bait leader, which is gonna snap onto here. And then if we move up here, at the top of this wind on leader, as you'll see, it's the monofilm is fed up inside of the Dacron to secure this end. And then a loop is stitched into this end for this end of the wind on leader. And this is so you can see it. This is so you can see it, but also there's no big knots to connect the 300 right. pound test to the 50 pound test. Right. This loop to loop connection is this loop in the Dacron and a loop made in the monofilament with a bimini twist. On this Dacron, after we've clipped on our bait and put it in the water, we clip on a long line clip that has a light and a sinker. The light can be activated by water pressure, just pushes it together, or you can turn it together like that, and it's ready to go down. Then, every 100 feet, we put wax thread flags on the line. One flag for 100 feet, two flags for 200 feet, three flags for 300 feet, etc. And we do that to all the rods so we can know, let them down quick and know where we're at. Then when we come to the flag that we want to use, we have a two liter bottle, silent light stick taped to the bottom of it, rubber band half hitched around the neck. We, loop, we lay that alongside the line, we flip the bottle over four or five times and we put the rubber band around the neck of the bottle. And we're let it, ready to let it out off the side of the boat. And we put out two with jugs on them, two straight down, and we're ready to fish. That sounds great. It's pretty simple.